Good morning. Today for devotion, we are in 2 Kings chapter 20, and we we're studying King Hezekiah, one of the few good kings uh, of Israel. And what made him good is that he he wouldn't stand for the false idol worship, got rid of him, uh, completely took him out of Israel's day-to-day -day life, and he followed God's word, let God guide him in his life. And he did, and he uh, used that for um, uh, during his reign. And as he did, uh, one day, God comes to him through the prophet Isaiah, who we studied uh, just last week. Um, comes to him through the prophet Isaiah, says, Hezekiah, you are sick and you are going to die. Hezekiah weeps. He weeps bitterly. And what does he do? Well, he goes to God and he prays. He says, God, I, I followed you all my life. Please spare me. God sends the prophet Isaiah back one more time with good news. Hezekiah, your prayer has been answered with a yes. You will live for 15 more years. And God also graciously gives him this, this really beautiful sign, um, something that God didn't have to do too, but <clears throat> asked Isaiah, what should I do with the, the shadow uh, by the temple steps? Shall I go forward 10 steps or should it go backward 10 steps? Hezekiah says, well, it normally goes forward 10 steps. Let's see it go backward. And God does. Sends the shadow backwards 10 steps. Beautiful account, right? It's a, and a beautiful reminder of what prayer is. You know, prayer, that opportunity to go to God no matter when, no matter for what reason, to go to God, recognize that he is the one in control of all things, putting our trust in him. And it's a beautiful count when God answers our prayers with a yes. Here he says yes to Hezekiah. Grants him more uh, years of life. God changes his mind, changes his plan, and listens to a prayer and says yes. Beautiful account. Maybe uh, in the comments, you know, you can mention ways where God has answered your prayer with a yes. Hallelujah for that, right? You know, for me recently, it's been stuff as little as praying to, to find the soccer camp jerseys that I misplaced and couldn't find. Found them. Or as something, you know, bigger, like, you know, praying for a healthy uh, baby girl and a healthy mom throughout the delivery process. It's a beautiful thing when God answers with a yes, but God, he also doesn't promise that. God doesn't promise he will always answer our prayers with a yes, but here's what God's guarantee is in prayer. God says that he will do what is best for you. And no matter what that answer is, whether it's a yes, whether it's a no, or whether it's not right now, sometime later, God's guarantee to you is he will always answer in a way that is best. Here we see it with a yes with Hezekiah. An, opera, or a, uh, an example of a no? How about Jesus as he prays in the Garden of Gethsemane, saying, Lord, if there's, if there's any other way, I don't want to have to suffer and die. God says, no. This is the only way. This is the only way to rescue my people. I know I'm going to have to give up my, my son. In order to do that, this is the only way. No. No, because that is what was best. That's God's guarantee to you. So go to him today in prayer. Whatever on, whatever's on your heart, whatever's on your mind, go to him and see how God answers, but knowing that God will say, will answer, his guarantee is that it will be best for you. Let's pray and thank God for this. Dear Lord, we thank you for this gift of prayer that wonderful blessing that you allow us to talk to you, to come to you, and to know that you will answer, and that you will answer, and you can and will change your mind and change the, the course of your action. Lord, we thank you for this wonderful blessing, but allow us to have the trust when we go to you in prayer, to know that no matter how you answer, that you answer with what is best for us. Allow us to have that, and. Today, as uh, the kids and families go back to school, Lord, we ask that you watch over them. We ask that you 
grant them health and safety grant them wisdom and, and learning and may everything be done in a in a reasonable safe and healthy way lord we pray all this in jesus name amen god's blessings on your day